said all the significant others will be there minus Louis, Luis Relajas. Okay. Um, we did find out that they are, which remember Teresa was running around. Oh, we are absolutely not going to be filming my wedding. We and Louis want to keep it private in our love bubble. We want to keep the wedding private. Well, no, you're not. You're having your own special, which leads us to Dina Manzo. Dina Manzo damn well knew that Teresa was going to film it, whether it be on RHO and J or her own show. This is a very excuse for Dina, I'm sorry, Canteen, to back out. I heard from a family member that Dina said that her and Dave know that Louie is a shady mofo. Well, family okay. Member. There's a lot to unpack. Wait, you heard, from a, you heard from a family member of Dina's? Correct. That Dina and Dave just, what? The light bulb they, went on and it's like, wait a second. I think the light bulb went on at Teresa's 50th in Mexico. That's my opinion. Again, guys, that's my opinion. The other thing that I just said well, about they started. That's when it started dissipating after that. I mean, that makes logical yes. sense on, online. Right. If you really follow it online, that is right. when the love and the, the hearts and yes. going on each other's podcasts and all right. it's, there's something about that vacation. I think you're right. That's when right. Teresa was dancing on the tables and we're half naked with Priscilla half naked. Yes. Um, yeah. So I think that's, you know, I think they knew before, but I think that was the, um, the straw that broke the cameras back on, they were probably saying to themselves, what are we doing? Like, why are we putting ourselves in this situation with these people knowing that this is something shady going on? We don't need this, you know, my opinion. Right, but and I do the know- whole world is saying this and like, we're in this, like we're in headlines now. That's we right. are, We are on page six. We are, this is us. We are the best friends with Teresa and Luis. There you and, go. And when, you know, look, Dina does not, asking unlike all no. these other fame whores uh, that yes. that are no longer on the show that would cut off their their head and arm and, and leg <laughs> to be back on the show yeah dina, D- dina don't want dina don't want no. nothing nothing nope. from this this franchise no nope. no nope. so with that it was a very lovely easy excuse to say that i don't want to be a part of filming now for anyone who doesn't know about filming i filmed and I brought people on with me. A lot of my friends would come because when I was filming, we went to great restaurants and all that. And if they didn't want to be on camera, they just blurred your, your face out and you weren't on camera. Some people come in, they ask you, like they ask everyone when you're coming in to sign a release. If you don't want to be on camera, you just say, no, I'm not signing yours. So Dina could have very well come to the wedding and just not been on camera. It was very, very easy, but she chose not to come. So just so you know. Yeah. I mean, that's a yes. good point. They, and yes. we've seen it. We've seen every franchise of every reality show where they blur someone's face. Correct. Correct. It happens. It happens. So just so you know that. So all these little excuses are excuses. Okay. So I see a backing off. I'll, I think we'll be seeing more of that. Um, again, I, we, uh, David and I both always said, no matter what Teresa said, she was going to film this. Quite frankly, if so, I, me and David discussed, we don't know exactly how much she was paid. We're thinking around a million. That's hard to pass up. That's hard to pass up. So, you know, listen, I don't blame her for that. I, I, mean, blame, I blame her for the lies. Oh, never. Oh, won't do it. Oh, no. Me and Louie want to get the hell out of here. You Stop lying. You're going to do it. She, yeah, I think she knew she was going to do it. And I think like, I don't see how it's less than a million because look, I mean, you just say no. And they say, but we actually, this, there's, there's a million people that have been with you moving into a brand new house where you didn't right. want to sit your ass on a toilet that was used. And your Correct. husband, this, this man hands you wads of cash. And then, yep. you know, he's in jail and he's deported and you're deported. And, I mean, we have, we have known Gia since she was a, 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 yes. a, a little thing. No, sorry. These people want this full closure of your life. One and she says, no, it's no, no. Okay. Well, here's 750. No, that's right. I, I, I don't even think it's a million. I, I would think it's over a million, well, but it could be, it's, it it's could at be. least a million. And so think about it. A million. That pays for the wedding and then some. 
Well, I think she probably even went back to the venue and said, listen, you're getting a free commercial. You need to, you know, give us a better deal, including those new invitations. I think the whole ball game changed because once they're filming, everybody gets a free commercial. Um, you know, so it is what it is. So go ahead, Teresa, knock yourself out. Um, I'll be around for the divorce too. You know, we'll be discussing that in a couple of years. Um, I see you're so very anyway. positive about this, Kim. No, yeah, and, and it's going to be her show. It's not going to say, you know, Margaret. It's going to say, you know, Margaret, Teresa's friend. It's now, you know how they do it. It's no longer RHO It'll be, no. we'll start, it'll start. It'll start Teresa. It'll start Louise. It'll start yep. Gia. I'm sure everyone's getting a salary. Absolutely. For this. Melania's Absolutely. got her salary. I mean, those are yep. way smaller salaries, but right, there's but they no still get way. paid. Yep. Teresa's like, okay, you know what? Fine. Give me a million and give each of them whatever. And that's, that's right. That's she's not exactly stupid. Right. No, no. Um, right. I, I think that she knew. It. Yeah, it's hard. Um, by the way, no, it is hard. Um, okay. So you think you don't buy it. You don't buy that. Like Dina just, I mean, I kind of agree with you. If you want, listen, this is not, you know, you're turning 43, you're turning 50. This is like, this is not, you know, it's like a, one of those milestone birth. This is a right. wedding, a wedding. a wedding. You are not going to miss a friend of yours wedding. You can come in and even if they're filming it, you can be in the corner. Yeah, of course, of course. you're Dina Manzo. You're going to make it onto the TV. But yeah, you say, but, I don't want to be filmed. And not for nothing, and they, Teresa, they can't do it. They Teresa can't do it. Judice could speak up and say, Dina will not be filmed. No. Seriously. And she's coming and you'll blur her out. And they would have no fucking choice. Teresa could speak up and say, well, listen, if you don't sign an agreement that you can be sued, she, like you said, she could have just been in the background and she don't want to go. And there's, I think there's way more reasons than that. It's just my opinion. And uh, what I heard through the grapevine to a family member, um, they know he's shady. So time to back off. Time to back off. Right. And it will just fade and ever listen there. I, I don't think Teresa wants a falling out publicly and I, Dina certainly no. does it. It'll just no. be, there'll be no more pictures with them together and yeah, go on yep. their life. And that's, that's sad though, because this, it is be, sad. this was a friend of hers. This was an actual yeah. friend. Well, listen, that, listen, this is par for the course with Teresa. Very par for the course. She doesn't hold on to any friends. I said that right from the beginning. I said that. So, um, yeah, also, also I have another, and then I have to go back to Jen Shaw afterwards. Yeah. Yeah. So there's a, you know what it is? I like to, um, say these things as they come to my mind, because then I'll forget. And this is very important shit. So now from another very good source, I was told that in 2019, when Dolores Catania and Teresa were both single, both not married, single, Luis went to one of Vanessa's best friends and was talking about Dolores and Teresa. Um, and I think he had his sights set on them at that time because he, 